This is Strictly Prophetic with the Global Prophet, Apostle Dr. Elijah Kofi King. The Spirit of God says, tell my son, yes. tell my son to be content with the little he has. For in due time, what he has asked me, okay. I will grant him and I will give it to him. Okay? okay. So, yes, the Lord said, be content. And I know what God is talking about because there is a strong prophetic ministry like the prophets of old. Okay? okay? Their mantle is upon you and you desire the manifestation of that mantle so much, mantle. so much, that if care is not taken and you are not content with the little God is giving you pair, where your spiritual level is now, you will yes. go ahead of the Holy Spirit. You will take a step out of the way of God. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, yes, I, I, I know what you're talking about. Good, so it makes sense to you, right? Yeah, yes, it good. makes sense to me. Good, good, good. So God said, be content with the little he is giving you. The small, small dreams and the small, small discernments that are coming to you in this particular season. Be content with it and allow the flow of the Holy Spirit step by step until you get to that place where he himself finds it fit to release that measure of anointing upon you. But in your life, you are going to manifest the ministry of the old prophets. God is going to use you in the prophetic very, very deep. Things that are hidden from many, many, many prophets. You in particular, you become the friend of God that God will share intimacy with you. God will reveal to you intimate stuff about people and about nations to you. But you have to be patient. Otherwise, you will miss your way and you will miss your ministry. Okay. Yes, Papa. Mm. Yes, Papa. The Spirit of God says, tell my son also not to be laughing at people. <clears throat> okay. Mm. He said, tell my son also not to be laughing at people because as it is now in the realm of the spirit, a workmate have taken you to a voodoo shrine and a voodoo altar. Mm. Mm. So there's something on the way, very wicked. It is on the way coming. Jesus. Mm. It is on the way coming, but we are going to stop it in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm. Amen. Amen. So Amen. if in the name or by you doing your work as a medical doctor, if you come across people and something is funny, don't 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 laugh at them. Don't make mockery of them, even okay. behind their back. Even behind their back. Okay. But especially your workmates also. Your workmates also. Don't become so okay. don't become so familiar that you take things certain things for granted and then you make certain okay. comments or you pass certain comments that will look down on anyone because already something has happened and somebody has summoned you before a voodoo shrine and it is coming, there is a snake bite. There is a snake bite I saw, there is a snake bite I saw hit you in front of your door, in front of your house, in front of your door and I saw you passed out and you were, you were attacked in front of your door. In front of your door. But I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I release the lightning and the thunder of God. And I strike the head of that serpent that has been sent from that altar to come and attack you in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. From today, from today, your spiritual eyes are going to open. Amen. And what you'll be seeing, you'll be seeing, you'll be seeing some blue, blue light. Light, blue, blue, blue light in front of you. Yes, Papa, I've been seeing it. You've already been seeing it. Good. Yeah, I see some blue lights. Yes. Good, good. Then shout fire, 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 fire. Fire, 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 fire. Now, anytime you see the blue lights around you, you should know that it is the presence of angels that have come around you. Okay, Papa. And the more you become conscious of their presence, the more you will grow in the prophetic. The more your spirit will become alert. So when they minister to you, Amen. you will be able to perceive and get it and receive it. Amen. So you are already in the prophetic flow, but I pray for you. I pray for you that you'll be patient because if you are not patient, you, you, you will consult a spiritualist so you can speed up the process. And that will, that will just destroy your purpose and the calling of God on your life. 
Amen. Mm, so just be patient. Yes, Papa. Just be patient. After today, God is going to increase your spiritual scope and the spiritual antenna is going to be sharper. And God is going to take you from, from class to class, from class to class until you get Amen. to that realm where I am now. Amen. Mm. Amen. Yes, Papa. I receive it in mm. the name of Jesus. Mm. Mm. Le hadaba yadaba, kabra gadaba gadaba, baso le bianda, labranto di bianta, le hadibi kataya. You shall not be put to shame. You shall not be put to shame. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you shall not be put to shame, neither shall you die before your time. I cancel the spirit of premature death. In the name of Jesus, every power that has been sent to come and attack you at your door or at your gate. For you to become sickly and die. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. And I command the archangels of God to guard your gate, Amen. to guard you, to Amen. guard your door, and to guard your house. Amen. In Jesus' mighty Amen. name. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. There are three Amen. there are three levels of attack. There are three levels of attack the enemy is sending your way. Jesus. And the reason why. The enemy is sending this attack your way. You see, whatever that compelled you to say in, in the beginning of 2023, you need a prophet to speak in your life and you need to see what is ahead of you. It was just the spirit of God saving your life. Amen. Mm. Whatever that compelled you, it was nothing but just the spirit of God saving your life. Because this particular year, my son, this particular year, doctor, it is not... A year for you to play when it comes to yes, Papa. spiritual warfare. There are three levels of, of attack I am seeing. The first attack, I am seeing an attack on your child. On your child. I'm seeing an attack on your child. How many months pregnant is your wife? Uh, she's currently about 17 weeks. 17 weeks so so how many months is that so that's that, that's about four months that's about four months okay so that is the first that is the first attack i am seeing that is the first attack i'm seeing and i'm going to go into details once i finish with all the three attacks number three number two attack i am seeing upon your life this year 2023 is an attack for you to lose your job also and then number three the third attack is an attack to separate you and your wife Jesus. The attack of divorce to separate you and your wife. So this three, this three level of attacks. The first one means that it means that if your wife is heavily pregnant up to four months, then you have to start anointing her belly every day, every day. Okay. Yes. Anoint her belly yes. and prophesy over the baby. Anoint the belly and prophesy over the baby. I am not seeing the face of the baby, but I'm seeing the body structure of the baby, and it looks like a baby boy. Have you done a scan? Yes, we've done a scan, and the sonographer said it's it's a boy. It's a boy. But we wow. should wait till yeah, we should wait till 18 weeks for it to be clear. Okay, it is already clear because prophetically, I'm seeing the 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 body of a baby boy. You know, the masculine body of a of a boy is different from the feminine body of a girl. Girl, yes. Good, good. So I'm seeing a baby boy. So I have already scanned the pregnancy of your wife. You don't need to go to, you don't need to go and subject your wife to another scan again because what I see, what I see is correct, or what I have seen, I know it is correct. Your your baby boy has to be anointed every day, every day, every day. Pour oil on the womb and speak to the baby. Prophesy over the baby. What do you want the baby to become in future? Speak over the baby and declare that in labor, in labor, you will not lose your wife and you will not lose this boy. You will not lose this boy. In labor, you will not lose your wife, you will not lose this boy. It's a spiritual warfare. So I'm not going to say I'm praying for you and it is done. You have to, it is something you need to work on every day because even if I pray for you today, when they go into their coven to have a meeting, they will bring a, a new Jesus. attack again. Jesus. Good. So it's a constant prayer you have to pray over your wife. Constant prayer you have to pray yes. over your wife. Now, the third level of attack, the enemy is bringing your way, which is concerning your career as a medical doctor. It has to do, doctor, it has to do 
yes, sir. with the promotion that is coming for you. The Spirit of God, I saw you, I saw you seated on a throne. I saw you seated on a throne and you were dressed like a king or like a chief. But it is not a physical chieftaincy, it's a spiritual kinship that God has given to you, and it is going to come through yes. your work, your career. So there is a promotion. Yes, there is a vacancy that is going to come, and there is a promotion that is looking for somebody you are working with. It is looking for the people, the place you are working, good. It is looking for the place you are working. There is a promotion that is coming for somebody to occupy a big position. But you know what? The people you are working with, the people you are working with, most of them have spiritual backing. But it is not the backing you and I know, which is godly backing. They have a demonic altar. Yes. They have demonic altars. Okay. They are consulting every day. Every day. Jesus. For them to see progress Jesus. in their career. But what I see is that that position that is there, it is you it is meant for. So if, yes. you, should, if you should pray hard this year, definitely, you will see yourself climb the ladder higher, higher, higher. You see yourself climb the ladder higher. Are you working in a government department or a private hospital? I'm currently in private. In private. Okay. Currently in private, yes. Okay. So don't be surprised. Don't be surprised if you are made the head of that clinic. Yes, sir. Amen. Papa. If you are made the head of that clinic. If you are made the head of that clinic. Yes, sir. Mm. Yes, sir. Amen. Every Amen. kind of contention. Every kind of contention. Jesus. Every kind of demonic contention over your destiny and over your career as a medical doctor. I set the Holy Ghost fire on it. I set the Holy Ghost fire Amen. on it. I set the Holy Ghost Amen. fire on it and I cancel it Amen. in the name of Jesus, Amen. the Son of the living God. Amen. Mm. Amen. 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 Mm. How many doctors do you, do you have in the clinic you are working? Okay, so we, we have, we the permanent doctors, we are two, myself and one lady. Okay. We are general. We are not specialized here, but we have special specialized doctors like a gynecologist, mm. like a physician specialist, like a surgeon. Uh -huh. But we, the, my classmates or my intimates, my rank, we are just two. We are permanent. We are just two. Mm. And they recently brought um, a, a, a doctor to become the um, clinical coordinator to coordinate us. The, the vacancy was there, but I don't know. They they said. Uh, from what I heard, they said, me, me, I had been, uh, uh, so, they, so they brought someone from outside to be the head for clinical, for the clinical coordination. Mm. So they said, oh, had been in what way? In the sense that, like, like according to them, I say like, me, pistado, but like me, everything that I do, I want to charge them or something. So they want somebody who will not, uh, that's, that's what I heard. Okay. Okay. What I believe is that what is meant for you will come to you. Amen. Yes, what is Amen. meant for you will come to you. If that position is what the Spirit of God is referring to, whoever has come to occupy that position will not stay. Once you, you apply prayer, the person will not stay and they will end up giving it to Amen. you. If it is not that position, then there is another one that is coming for you. Another one. Amen. Mm. Amen. 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 Mm. Are you planning to start a new project or you started a new project or you are planning to start a new uh, business or something? Oh, currently I'm trying to see if I can start some online business. Uh -huh. But I've not, yet, I've not yet fully decided. I pray. Uh -huh. I pray the favor of God over that project you are about to start, that God will grant you speed, that you will not start and break in the middle. Amen. But when you start, you will Amen. complete it and you will see results and you will see profits in Amen. the name of Jesus, the Son Amen. of the living God. When you get home today, I need you to anoint your door, anoint your door. Because the attack I saw, I am still seeing it. Even after I have prayed, I am still seeing a snake biting you in front of your door. Mm -hmm. So when you get home, it may, it may not be a physical snake that will bite you. It will be a spiritual bullet they will send and it will hit you right in front of your door and you will pass out. So when you get home, anoint your door and anoint your gate as well. Amen, Papa. Mm. Uh, talking about that, I, just recently I had 
an altercation with uh, one of the workers. Mm. Uh, I referred I referred the case to a different hospital, and he was the ambulance driver. So when he got there, he said, um, "I didn't call the referral site, and I brought him here, and he's 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 there." Um, waiting and stranded. So he called me and he was angry and I told him that he should stop that. I also gave it to him and I said, it's not my fault. You are looking for the best uh, best management for the patient. So you should calm down and let's find solutions to the problem. So he was also angry and I was also angry. But later he called to apologize. Aha. Uh -huh. So I don't know whether it's from that anger. Definitely. The person, the person, the spirit of God showed me is a male, but I, I don't want to victimize anyone. The most important thing is that you are alerted and you will take it into prayer. Amen. Amen. Mm. Amen. amen. You yes, will take it into prayer. Yes, sir. Mm. Yes, sir. There, are, there are evil forces that have, that have been alerted in the realm of the spirit concerning your calling and your ministry. Uh, so th these evil forces, they are trying to use people you work with and they are trying to use even the woman you are with. Mm, I don't know if apart from your wife you have a side chick, but to tell you the truth, the message I'm receiving for you concerning a woman is that there's a woman in your life who is not telling you the truth. Mm. There's a woman in your life who is not telling you the truth. So uh, I don't know who is connected to, but that is the message I am receiving. So prayer needs to be offered and awareness has been created and the rest lies in your hands. How you, 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 you take your steps, how you take your steps. Yes, Papa. Mm. Yes, Papa. But, but why, why is your, you, you said it's your mother, right? That's what you said. My mother. What did you say? What did you say? Right now. About the woman. About the woman. Did you say anything? No. He, no, 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 no. The only woman in my life is my wife and my, and my mother. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. So, yes. so, let me ask you this question. Why is your wife having double-mindedness about your marriage? Because you've not been married for that long. Yes. Papa. So I'm wondering why I'm receiving this message. Okay. Until unless the spirit reveals, yes. Papa. Okay. So the spirit has already revealed, and I'm going to tell you and guide you, so you can also yes, be Papa. helped. You can also be helped. The Bible says, when a blind man leads a blind man, both of them shall fall into a pit. But when one who has a foresight is able to alert you to say there is a pit in front of you, your life is saved and your life is preserved. Yes, Papa. Mm. So now, the Holy Spirit said, I should tell you, it's a bit sensitive, but it will save your marriage. Yes, Papa. It will save your marriage. And I don't even know how to put it because it's a bit sensitive. Yes, Papa. Mm. Okay, let me tell you, as raw as it is, let me tell you, don't overchop yes. your wife. Don't overchop your wife. Okay, yes, Papa. Does it make sense? Yes, Papa. Mm, don't overchop your wife like, like a marathon, a marathon sex. Don't do it to her. Because I'm seeing her having double-mindedness. Remember the three levels of attack I, I mentioned? Your unborn baby, your marriage, and your career. Those are the three angles the enemy wants to hit. And I was wondering why the enemy will attack your marriage. But now I know where it's going to come from. Yes, Papa. Mm -hmm. So don't be doing marathon sex with your wife. Don't be doing marathon sex with your wife to prove that you are a man. Even you, you grow old quicker if you continue like that. Yes, yes, Papa. Mm -hmm. You grow old quicker. Just, yes, Papa. just because you want to prove a point that you are a man. You know, some women like it, but some women also, when it becomes too much like that, especially the fact that she is pregnant and heavily pregnant for that matter. Kakrebi, now we be, why? Doctor, doctor. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm, I am seeing you also. If any connection man comes to you to say, give him money, he can help you get a visa to UK, they will eat your money. Jesus. They will eat your money. Are you communicating with anyone in that regard? 
definitely no, but I want to travel this year, so I don't know. I've not yet con communicated with anyone. If you want now. to, if you want to travel, don't use any middleman. Okay. Don't use any middleman. Just go straight straight to the embassy. Get the requirements they require. As a medical doctor, you are in a very very good position to get because those people they even need more health practitioners in their system. So it will be easy for you to get, in addition to the favor and the prayer of God upon your life. If you use, if you use any middleman, they will eat your money. They will eat your money. They will eat your money. I see it. If you use any middleman to help you acquire a visa to Europe, you are finished. They will eat your money. Yes, Papa. Mm. They will eat your money. Papa. Okay, so this is the word I have for you. Make sure you don't laugh at people. When you pray, also mention in your prayer anyone who, out of envy, has mentioned your name before any voodoo altar. Let the fire of God reverse their attacks back to them. Amen. Mm. Amen. Amen. You, you are blessed and you are favored. Amen, Papa. You will carry your baby boy. Your baby boy will manifest Amen. in the physical, alive, and you will dedicate your baby Amen. boy in your church on Amen. the altar of the Amen. Most High God. You will not be divorced. Amen. Your wife will not run away from you. Confusion, Amen. misunderstanding, resentment in marriage. I cancel it. I pray Amen. for the favor of God in your career. You shall not lose favor Amen. in your career. You shall not be, Amen. you shall not be sidelined in your career. In the name of Yeshua, Amen. the Son of the Living God, Amen. you are blessed. Your Amen. going out is blessed. Amen. Your coming in is blessed. And I pray for the Amen. protection of God. You will not pass out. You will not be sickly. You will not Amen. be struck Amen. suddenly by a strange sickness whilst you are at home, Amen. whilst you are in your room. Amen. In Jesus' mighty Jesus. name. Amen and amen. 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 Shout amen. fire, 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 fire. Fire, 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 fire. You are blessed, doctor. Amen. You are blessed. Thank you, Papa. Anything you want to say before I leave, I go? Oh, I thank you very much. Father, in the spirit of God, you use you to minister to me. And mm. everything you said is right on point. And I believe that the deliverance that must come my way has, has come my way. Amen. And I also have an insight concerning what is ahead of me. Wonderful. In the name of Jesus. Wonderful. In the name of Jesus. Wonderful. God bless you, Doc. God bless you, Papa. Okay. Apostle Dr. Elijah Coffee King is worth hearing. <laughs>